All right, in this video, I'm gonna share with you the most effective reality shifting methods. I will give you no fluff. This is gonna be pretty much straight to the point. So don't click away, watch this video, and I hope you enjoy. So number one is the pillow method. If you have already heard these techniques, please stay and watch because I will give you ones you haven't heard. So the pillow method involves you writing a script, which is basically just a really short description of the desired reality you want. Put the script underneath your pillow, lay down and go to sleep, lay down in a starfish position like this, relax all your muscles and don't move until you have fallen asleep. The idea is you should wake up in your desired reality and you can use affirmations throughout the day. You can use other techniques alongside this, but the idea is the pillow method because you have the script and the intention under your pillow, it's more likely to manifest. Next, we have the I am method. This is based on awareness and kind of identification with your new reality. So you wanna constantly tell yourself, I am in my new reality. I am my desired reality. I am whatever it is you want to do or be in your desired reality. Pretty simple, but you need to really embody that belief. When you say I am, Whatever it is, like I am an athlete, for example, you really need to believe it with every piece of your being. We next have the Raven method. You've probably heard of this already, but this is the one that went viral on TikTok. Uh, the idea is you basically put your script under your pillow, lay in a starfish position like this on your bed, don't move any muscles and count from one to 100 or higher. I've seen people have really good success with counting to 500. I would say somewhere in between is probably good, 250, 300. With every count, so you're gonna count in your head one, I am in my desired reality. Two, I am shifting. Three, I have shifted. Whatever affirmation you want to give, you need to say it in between each number in your head. The key here is to really take your time. It takes the average person roughly 20 minutes to fall asleep. So you need to be doing it for at least 20 minutes. Um, you know, try not to keep track of the time, but just really slow down and be mindful when you do this. The idea is that when you get to your desired count, let's say if it's 200, 300, you need to then really strongly focus on your desired reality. All right, the subliminals method, pretty easy. You basically either do any of the techniques I'm mentioning in this video while listening to a subliminal track, or you just lay down and listen to a subliminal track. I am gonna post, if I haven't already, uh, I'm gonna post some subliminals to this channel, so just subscribe and wait for those if they're not already posted. Next, we have the elevator technique for reality shifting. Pretty interesting one. So you first wanna lay in the starfish position and listen to a subliminal track. This is kind of combining a few techniques together. While you're listening to the subliminals, you need to imagine yourself in an elevator. And this can have as many floors as you want, ideally one of those really big American-style hotel elevators with at least 50 floors. As you go up each floor, you tell yourself or you feel that you're getting closer to your desired reality. When you get to your desired floor, let's say floor 70, for example, you will open the door and step into the floor that is your desired reality. You need to then see the doors opening, walk through into the floor and accept your new experience. Then what you need to do is to lay down somewhere on that floor in that reality and then go to sleep. The idea is then you will wake up in your desired reality. I say this in every video, but you need to also scroll down and comment, I will shift tonight, or I am shifting, or I can reality shift, because these affirmations, when you write them out physically, they become much more likely to happen. I'm not just saying that, they really do. By the way, what is your desired reality? I'd really actually like to know what you are trying to manifest, so leave a comment with that as well. And then we have the train method. Basically, you imagine yourself being on a train. You have your eyes closed the whole time. Really take your time and just kind of feel and sense where you are and what, maybe you can feel the ground rocking underneath you. You can hear the train tracks. Maybe you can hear some sounds outside, for example. Really visualize yourself there, but keep your eyes closed in your visualization. And then when you feel like you have reached your stop, the stop being your desired reality, then you open your eyes and then you hopefully will be in your desired reality. So I hope this has made sense. Leave a comment letting me know what your desired reality is and I'll see you next time.